Alice and I met about 10 years ago at a VCA acting course. We just remained friends and we always wanted to find something to work on together. I remembered observing Alice and Greg when they were shooting short films and admiring their ability to risk and even fail because that's where the real growth can happen. You can capture these really raw, authentic moments sometimes from that and I just love how they don't always have to get it right or perfect. It takes a lot of courage and tenacity to follow that inner compass and they're a real example for other aspiring artists. I really liked playing Zoe. I loved playing a flawed character and I could relate to her, to her frustration and the losses and stresses she faced being a person who wears their heart on their sleeve. She's also funny. That was really liberating to play someone so quirky. I could really draw my own wackiness. Let's just see how this plays out. I remember having a few phone conversations with Alice, developing the character of Zoe and wanting her to be really kind of imperfect and flawed and a little uh, messy and all over the shop. Just not what it seems because there's this glamorized idea of actresses and actors in the industry and it's it's just not how it is. I think Alice and Greg did a really beautiful job with her. <laughs>